Alrighty. Almost made it to where I'm planning on spending the night. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous day. A little breeze right now. About 70, 75 degrees or so. Saw a few day hikers, but I don't expect it to be anybody down here but me probably tonight, but we shall see. But uh, so far, been a lovely walk into the woods. I'll set up camp here in a little bit. Show you where I'm going to sleep for the night. Alright, camp set up for the evening. Uh, I decided to camp on this side of the little creek. So I got my new tarp out. This is the uh, underground quilts. Uh, underground quilt outdoor equipment is the website. But this is their call it penny pincher tarp. It's a little bit less expensive option. It's uh, I think I paid 85 bucks. I think shipped to the door. I did not have it seam sealed or did not have them do a stuff sack. Uh, so that part saved me a little bit. I think it's a few dollars more to have that done. Got my Warbonnet XLC hammock under there. I'll set it up in porch mode tonight. It's not supposed to be any rain. So I'm going to set it up this way. Um, I'm supposed to get down to about 50, maybe 52. I've got my Apex DIY top quilt, lightweight top quilt in there. Supposed to should keep me warm down to 50. We'll see how that works tonight. And then my Greylock 3 under quilt. Uh, get us get me some dinner going here in just a minute. Um, I think I got one of those Nor rice sides for tonight. So it's Easter Sunday, so I had a big lunch with the uh, family before I headed up here. So not super hungry, but. Alright, so for coffee this morning, I'm having Jiva Cubes, J-I-V-A, these little coffee cubes that, uh, they're, I guess they're kind of like an instant or concentrated coffee. Uh, if it's instant, it's the best instant that I've had. Uh, Via is okay. Start from Starbucks, I've had that. But, uh, these Jiva Cubes, I think I like the best. You just... They come in little individually packed uh, <coughs> plastic packages. You can get them on Amazon. Uh, I think it was like ten bucks for a package of ten or something like that. But um, so they're you know they're kind of pricey, dollar a piece, but they're good, good instant coffee. So I'm heating up some water there, and then we will have some coffee and a pop tart here shortly. Blueberry. Well, had a good night's sleep last night. Beautiful, huge, clear, full moon last night. And I'm gonna walk up the hill here to the shelter and a little exploring around that way. And then uh, eat some lunch. Uh, 
don't know if you can see the view back over behind me, but that's the, uh, the waterfall back that way. Chihaw Falls. Spoke to the family that was camping across the creek from me. Nice mom, dad, and two boys from uh, Georgia, I believe. So they first time they've been up here. So uh, they were planning on doing the loop uh, here that uh, Chinabee Silent and Penhody Loop, but. Uh, Oh, I guess that's the Skyway Loop is the official name. But there's supposed to be some weather coming in tomorrow, so so they opted to uh, not do the loop, just to do an overnight, I think. It's a beautiful morning. Gorgeous out today. So, uh, real quick, a little, little public service announcement for other campers out there. If you're going to camp hike on the trails clean up after yourself I don't know if you see that there's toilet paper out there on the ground there's there's other trash up here orange peels ramen noodle packs of course the, the typical cigarette butts in the fire pit glass you know really take the time to clean up after yourselves there's plenty of more toilet paper all out there through the woods. I won't bore you with that, but uh, come on. You can do better than this. I mean, the paper stuff, you could at least burn the paper stuff. Really? You could at least burn the paper. And if you're going to go use the bathroom in the woods, dig a proper hole. Bury it. Don't leave sign for others. Okay, rant over. This is probably the remains of an old whiskey whiskey steel would be my guess. Although that just looks like a 55 gallon drum there, but considering the location on this little creek right here, I'm betting that this at some point in time was an old whiskey steel. I don't know if you can hear that. There's a hole in the ground here and there's water. You hear the water running over there. That's pretty cool. Alright, so I'm headed back up the forest road to the car. It's been a really nice overnight kind of a short trip but uh, a good one very relaxing and beautiful weather so headed back up to the car now might take a hike out to one of the points up on the ridge up there for lunch uh, I just had a snack there at the shelter it's not quite lunch time so just ate a quick snack. I'm gonna make my way back to the car and then I might drive up to one of the overlooks and walk out for lunch. We'll see.
See you next time.